Is it here for you both? Or no, just, just me. Is it here for your second dose? Yeah. I've been a patient in hospital, Blackburn Hospital, going for treatment for dialysis since about 24, 25 years. Blackburn have been brilliant. I used to go for dialysis three times a week and the nurses on the renal ward are fantastic. They're more like my friends. I used to look forward to seeing my friends, not going into hospital for treatment. First, I got a phone call from um, Preston saying you're on the transplant waiting list. With all this COVID going on, do you still feel safe? So I, I listened to everything and I said, yeah, I'm still, I'm still fine about coming in for a transplant if I get one. But no, not hoping I'll get one soon, you know, just like I've been waiting 10 years. The 26th of um, October, I had this phone call and it was uh, from the hospital thinking my daughter's had a baby. This was in the middle of the night, so they all woke up. My husband, my kids and... Nobody rings on the house phone. <laughs> yeah, no one, no, no one rings on BT anymore, so... You know, my husband, my daughter, you know, they were surprised. Mum, what's, what's up? What's up? I shared a baby. I said, no, I've got a kidney transplant waiting for me. You know? So they said, just bring an overnight bag and we'll see, you know, and take it from there. And then went in, they did all the usual procedure. They have to do bloods, this and that. And thanks to God, you know, it was a perfect match. I think when the phone call came, um, it was just, it was, um, it, it was scary. Um, because when we've gone for a big operation, it's not a small, it's a big operation, especially during COVID. But because of how long we'd been waiting, it was it was a miracle, honestly, because you, you don't expect to get that phone call after waiting so long for a transplant. The, the way I felt safe from um, walking in and having the treatment done and everything, you know, it, it, was, it was brilliant. You know, they were very good and amazing staff, you know. Nice and relaxed. That's it. Think of nice times ahead. Happy times. That's lovely. Very brave. Yeah, it will be happy times after you've had this. Yeah. It will be like relief, won't it? Sense of relief. We're going in the right direction. Yeah. Yeah, we're going in the right direction. Patients like me who are vulnerable as well and have got a long term illness, I'd advise them don't be scared, you know, it's just like a normal prick in your arm. You know, these volunteers, the NHS staff, everybody. They're working so hard to get all these vaccines out and over and done with so everybody's safe and we can all get back to a normal life. If you don't have health, you don't have anything. Yeah. You know, health is a massive thing and this country, you know, touch wood, you know, um, it, it, this country's health system and healthcare is amazing. Yeah, um, yeah, thank you.